stayed in South Africa, he didn't leave, and the church brought his fiance out from Ukraine or Russia, and they actually got married in the church um, later on. So there you can see the, uh, the hall, it's quite, quite a large hall. The terrace came in over here, at this door over here next to the stage. I was sitting fourth row from the back over there. Uh, so I had to shoot from there all the way down to the bottom over here. Um, and by God's grace, one of my rounds hit one of the, the attackers. And so they knew that they were being shot back at and uh, so left the hall. But after I took my first two shots, what I did was I ran out this back door. And the idea was to go outside the church hall, run around the back, come in behind them here and shoot them in the back at close range. Uh, the 38 Special Revolver is just a little two-inch barrel. It's not made for shooting long distances across <coughs> a thousand people. It's uh, made for self-protection within two or three meters. And so um, I ran out the back door and as I came around the corner of the church, I found the attackers already all at the getaway car. So I hadn't realized when I ran out that I'd actually hit somebody with my first two, one of my first two shots. And because of that, they ran away. Um, later we found out that they actually wanted to kill every single person in the church and apparently were going to throw petrol bombs. I don't know what you call them here, but petrol in the glass and they light it. And then fire starts everywhere and burns everybody to death, those who don't get hit with the bullets. So uh, by God's grace, they didn't get round to that part of the attack. I came around the corner, they were standing at the getaway car, and uh, I still had three shots left in my gun, so I took another three shots at them. One of the shots got embedded in the car door, which helped the police uh, find the vehicle and be able to trace it back. And we found out later that one of my first two shots uh, hit one of the terrorists on his hand and so drew blood and the blood got onto the seats of the getaway car. And so that's how through forensics, uh, they were managed to be caught and um, taken to court and uh, prison.